we are. We're at the, we're gonna say we're at the homeowner's house and um, we're ready to start edging. Um, first things first is do a test. Just to roll it back and forth and see if you can, see if it moves. We can tell that this thing is not level. Um, the reason being is the wheels get misadjusted and all of a sudden if it's not the same setting on each side for the most part it's going to be out of out of sync. So this first test to do is to turn it on and then just touch down on the old finish to see where it's cutting. That's the first thing to do to see where we are cutting at. So we can see it's cutting way over here, which we don't want to do, first of all, because you're not going to get close to the base. Second of all, it's going to make it really hard to get flat because how are you going to make it flat while you're cutting over here? Um, it's easy to tell right here because you know exactly where you're going. There's no guesstimate. Also, we have a nice little ridge right there because it's cutting too hard on that side. <clears throat> so we would like to get over and around in this area right here between the 12 and 1 o'clock for the most part. Um, I find that the easiest for our guys to cut with. So to do that, what we first want to do is we don't want the machine sitting too far up, but we also don't want it sitting too far back, so that way we're getting a, too much of this and not enough pressure on the front. So first things first would be to adjust the wheels. So we can see that this is really high, so that or really low for the wheel right here. And we can see on the other side that this one's really high. So what we want to do is just get them even to begin with and then go from there. So we'll loosen up that thing and we'll move it down. We have about three rings right there or so, two and a half. We'll go to the other side and do the same thing. So we have zero rings right there. Loosen it up. about three rings right there so that's just to begin to get our sample going here and by putting them um, down that far we're getting ample pressure on the front we might get be getting a little too much but we're gonna start from there this should be cutting if we are right in our assumption that these are even it should be cutting around the 12 o'clock 1 o'clock or 11 o'clock area so we'll do a test So now that the machine is balanced from the back to the front and most of its weight right here, we have a nice little try effect of a setup right here. We get a nice even cut for the most part and it's also going on our 12 to 1 o'clock area. Um, it, your preference can be either on the 11 o'clock or to the 1 o'clock, it doesn't really matter too much, just as long as you know where that circle cut is going so you can see where it's cutting right there. Pause it.